everybody, welcome back to another episode of the Cool Kids and the Missing Cool Kids and the Lame Dad here solo. And we're back here with a new band to the channel and they are under the progressive rock category and this is Victim of Illusion. So, and their song, Jamie's World. I have no clue what they're like, not sure what type of prog these guys are. We are going to find out together. So, you guys know me. I love my prog rock. I'm fussy on my prog rock. Area Knots here watching this. We know you guys love your prog rock. We're all Area Knots. So, let's cross fingers. We get a good one here and boom, boom, boom. Maybe. I, I don't know about the other songs. This has a industrial sound to it. Really enjoyable. I would say I kind of get like a kind of a um, stabbing westward meets a little bit of earlier tool meets. Not quite sure who it would be, but quite, quite enjoyable so far. So really nice heavy sound, really nice clean and heavy sound. I can hear the chords being played uh, cleanly. There's no sloppiness to this whatsoever. So really good sounding production So on this. I'll comment more on the lyrics and the uh, video part, but loving the sound of the singer. Like so far, this is good. She lives open, lives with baby hypnotized. another pause another stop let's head our 10 seconds back really loving the lyrical content of this song good structured lyrics not just you know repeat a few words over and over and it being you know written down in about 10 minutes this is a very well structured song about a girl who's locked herself in in a way so in case you didn't hear, the other band I was trying to think of, they kind of remind me of, is a mix between Carnival and Dead Letter Circus, uh, two Australian bands that are amazing. So that's what they're giving me a mix of between that, um, 
So a little Toolish uh, early vibe and uh, Stabbing Westward. That's the four bands that are kind of giving me a vibe of. So back to the lyrical. Really like the content of this. Liking that it's actually got deep substance uh, to the uh, lyrics and it's not just bubblegum flavory, repeat the same lines over and over with uh, some good music to it. So all around this song has been good. So musical note selection, the measure that they're, they're pushing you at, uh, you know, uh, for the beat per minute, it's not too high, but it's not too low. It's just enough to keep that driving force. So I'm giving you a, a nice hard edge to it. So I love hearing the bass in there. Well, I like to hear a little, I say this all the time. I like to hear that bass a little higher in that mix though, really, because it's got a good crunchy sound. I'm trying to pick up what he's using on that bass. So, all right, let's go. Boom, boom, boom. seconds guys longer than that let's go back 40 that whole guitar section was sweet the picking that pattern that he's doing on the notes and the repeats and then changing and then you know going into the solo off of it fuck yeah <laughs> at the end of that bar man that bar was packed hard but nicely done and tastefully done so it went right with the song and the feel of the song all right let's go boom 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 <laughs> video concept to this too you know how they're uh, showing this and explaining it the only thing that keeps on screaming out to me is that this is the female version of Jeremy from Pearl Jam minus the fact that she's not going into a classroom and shooting everyone up but he, they're showing the uh, mental um, state of you know the other side of the female with her character Jamie here instead of the character Jeremy uh, Pearl Jam uh, uses which I really like this concept that they're using. Actually, I must say, I don't like it. I love it. Ooh, that was a 
damn good video with a damn good freaking song, man. This is just all uh, credits at the end of it. All right, guys, victims of illusion, Jamie's world. Have to say, wow, wow, what a great. Why is my not wanting to song? I'm stuck on the full exit. There we go. What the heck happened there? The ice cream wouldn't pop down. Woo! So this was one hell of a song. All right, guys. So this was just one wicked song, one great video, one great topic to be uh, nailing and covering. So this is seven years old. Wow, seven years old. I'm just hearing of these guys. This is a thumbs up, guys. This is an automatic thumbs up. If you like this video as much as I love this video and song, make sure you give us a thumbs up because wow. So we can use the help. They definitely get only 207 thumbs up. That is ridiculous. We need to get the thumbs up on that, guys. This was a great, amazing song. Let's get the thumbs up on this. So the content was great. The music was great. The lyrical uh, presentation of vocals was great. Vocalist stayed in key the whole time. Never high, never flat, never off. Nailed it. So the measure changes in here, very great. Only complaint, let's get that bass up a bit higher. So let's hit that subscribe button. I generally don't hit subscribe for shots. I'm hitting subscribe. So go ahead and hold off on that bell, I think. I was tempted to hit it, but I think I'm going to go hold off on the bell. But if you like the video, this one here, as much as I love that one, thumbs up, please. It sure helps us out again. Make sure you hit that uh, subscribe button right down there in the left hand, or your right hand corner, my left hand corner of the screen. And click that notification bell so you got all our latest uploads and notifications. So, because you do not want to miss out on a great band like Victim of Illusion. So you do not want to miss out on these guys. So that's a good reason to click that notification bell for more bands like this because this is where you're going to find great independent bands. So until then, the Missing Cool Kids, Lame Dad Here Solo, peace out.